When you're not connected to your network, you won't be able to access the internet. So here's how to fix a network connection issue by watching this video from an alternate device and using the following steps on the impacted one. Make sure the physical Wi-Fi switch on your laptop is turned on. Usually an indicator light will be illuminated when it is on. Refer to your user's guide if you are not sure where it's located. On the right side of the taskbar, check to see if the Wi-Fi is turned on. If it isn't, click on it and turn it on. Also make sure that airplane mode is off. Now look to see if there is a Wi-Fi network you recognize. If there is one you trust, select it. If it already says connected, click disconnect, wait a moment, and click to connect again. Afterwards, try to get on the internet. If that didn't work, try using a different frequency for your network connection. Typically, consumer Wi-Fi routers broadcast at two different frequencies, 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz. These bands should appear as separate networks in the list of available Wi-Fi networks. If your list includes both networks, try connecting to the other network and see if this works. Next, go into Settings, select Network and Internet, and navigate to the Status page. Under Change Your Network Settings, click on Network Troubleshooter and follow the steps given. You can also try restarting your modem and wireless router. However, this process can vary, so here are some general steps. Keep in mind that when doing this, anyone that is connected to your Wi-Fi network will be temporarily disconnected. Unplug the power cables from your router and your modem. If the modem has a backup battery, the lights will stay on after you unplug the modem. If it does have a backup battery, remove it. Wait at least 30 seconds, and then reinsert the battery if you removed it, and plug the modem back in. The lights on the modem should start blinking, so wait for them to stop blinking, then plug your router back in, and wait a few minutes. When both the modem and the router are fully powered on, as indicated by their status lights, try to connect again. If you still need help or have questions, contact us on social media through Facebook or Twitter. You can also visit the Dell Community Forum to join in a chat and share info with other Dell users. Check out our other videos on this channel and become a subscriber today. If you like this video, give it a like and thanks for watching.